Hi, my name is Staff Sergeant Jacob Munoz, and yes, I'm in the United States Air Force. Yeah, America. Wait, 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 wait. Go back a little bit. Yeah, there. Yeah, I'm in the dental filler in the Air Force. I make teeth for a living. Yeah, that's a job in the Air Force, just so you know. Anyways, alright, let's get back to it. Yeah, so like I was saying, my name's Jacob. Being a gamer sometimes makes conversations awkward. When all you hear is stuff about football, and how much you were able to bench press that afternoon. Yo, bro, do you even lift? All the while, I'm just sitting there like, uh... Well, yeah, that team, you know, that team that, that made the play that one time. Oh, man. Yeah. As for my story, I have a pet snake named Onyx, of course. And I, uh, I love to draw. Even though sometimes it may take some work to get exactly what I want. In my spare time, you'll find me strolling around YouTube, finding funny videos, or even staying up late with nothing to do but watch cat videos. But my true love and pastime is of course playing video games. Anything from the newest thing out there? To the absolute classics. So anyways, that's enough about me. Let's listen to why we're actually here today. Doc wanted to do something special for Victoria in memory of Victoria. And he came up with a fundraiser called Extra Life. And this fundraiser would be for the gaming community. It just occurred to me that gamers should be able to do the things they love to, uh, to help sick and injured kids as well. And so Extra Life was born. 1,200 gamers showed up on October 15th in 2008. With this year's Extra Life Gaming Marathon, we're helping save kids' lives. You don't even have to be a crime-fighting superhero. Each and every year afterwards, it continued to grow. Gamers responded by being able to uh, game for their local hospitals. The next year, 4,500 gamers showed up, raised almost half a million dollars. The year after that, it was 15,000 gamers raising a million, and the next year, 17,000 gamers raising $2.1 million. Video games are like the number one form of entertainment on planet Earth, have been now for quite a while. Anyone could be involved in Extra Life. Gamers aren't that pale kid in mom and dad's basement. They're mom and dads, they're aunts and uncles. A young child, to an older adult, to a grandparent. You can take all that fun of playing games for 24 hours and reach out to your friends and bring them to your environment. Or if you want to play a board game, a card game. The funds that Extra Lifers raise can go to a variety of purposes in the local area at the local hospital. So maybe your extra $20 or your extra $50 goes to curing 87% of children with leukemia. They might buy an isolate for a baby that is born the size of a cell phone and has to fight for its life. I can guarantee you that with that money goes directly back to these children. To keep this from happening, again, to someone else's child. Getting involved with Extra Life is really simple. You just have to go to the website at extra-life.org, put in a few details in there, join a team if you'd like to, or create one. After that, it's as simple as fundraising with your friends and family. Let them know why you are doing this. They should know that the money you raise is going to stay local in your community. We never will truly lose Victoria because she will live for all of us through this.
It started with a little girl in Orange, Texas. All we have to say today. So, so we'll see, see you tomorrow you later at on news at whatever time, time it is. is at Victoria's house. Thank Bye. You. Hey there. I just wanted to say thanks for watching my video. I had a lot of fun making it. Uh, I'd really appreciate it if you guys came by and watched my stream. Um, like I said before, you don't have to donate if you don't feel like it, but go ahead and share this video out to your friends and family and let them know it's for a good cause. Um, I appreciate everybody, like I said before, and I'll see you there. All right, thanks, guys. Bye.